Okay, I'm going to run a electrical line from our garage, this post, all the way over to the chimney to our other garage. And I started by uh, putting in an insulator, and we'll go ahead and spin that in there. That'll be our start. Okay, I unspooled a, a good metal line. And we have a nice room here to lay it on. And the next thing we're going to do is throw that line over. And we have to go over the utility lines. So we're going to go over top of them and over to the chimney. Okay, the next I'm going to put an insulator that goes onto a pipe onto my long stretch of pipe which I'm going to feed down the chimney. And this will mark just like that on the pipe. Okay, we're going to send this pipe down the chimney and that's where our wire is going to run. I have the insulator connected on there and I have this pipe left over. We'll send it up and put it down the chimney. Okay, well, I've used these before, but not for a main wire. And this basically puts pressure on the wire to hold it in. And that just goes in there. And as it pulls, pulls through, it puts pressure on the wire. Now I'll hook this up. A little bit more on here, so. Well, I've seen these used many times for this. And I've done some lines in some different ways. But I have this adjusted to where I want it. And I'll just slide this in. And that puts pressure on the wire in there. And I'll loop this around the insulator that I put in and hook it in. And there we have it. Our wire is run from garage to garage. And from here, if you follow me, we'll run this across the roof. Over to where I have the fence coming up. And right below this is our fuse box. So we'll go ahead and run this down right to the fuse box. And then on the other side, we'll run that down into a current junction box. And we'll have it. We have our line across our two garages. Okay, now this is the chimney from our other garage. And I just ran the wire down the chimney. And I'll be clean out the wind. So now we're into the garage with no major... Uh, to news or anything like that. I didn't have to cut a hole in the roof or night, anything. So we're in. And our lines across the street. We'll take a look at it outside. There's our line going across the, the alleyway here. And now we have electric at both garages. Alright, here we are on the other side. Here, let me show you. That's our garage over there. Comes across to here. On this insulator, which is not a pipe. Now on this pipe, we'll, uh, we'll make a cover for this, and the bottom will cement it so it's, it's nice and sturdy. So I'll just drop some cement on the chimney, and that'll hold that nice and tight, and I think that's going to be nice and strong for our, our line. And we'll, we'll, uh, we'll cut something for here to hold it so it doesn't move around. We don't want that. But I'm just going to hit this with a little undercounting, because that's all I got. And that'll uh, keep it from rusting. So, no, normally I'd paint that, but maybe I will. But I'm going to spray some of this on and 
that's it. That's what I'm going to show you with this. The rest is just hooking up wires from uh, in the fuse box and into a box in this garage.